Who is Neil Armstrong? What is he famous for? What is Neil Armstrong famous for? Well, he was the very first person to place his foot somewhere. Where was that? You probably guessed it. It was the moon. He was the first astronaut to set foot on the moon. Armstrong was born in Ohio in the United States of America, and he was one of the famous Apollo mission astronauts. People had been dreaming for hundreds of years of going to the moon, but nobody had seriously attempted it until the Apollo astronauts started their quest. People thought, mm, maybe we could get to the moon with a, a weird mechanical device. And somebody wrote a story about a device that had a sloping ramp with a powerful spring that would propel a carriage to the moon. But we know, of course, that that couldn't work. Another man wrote a story a couple of hundred years ago about a man deserted on an island and he decided to get back to another island by rigging up a contraption that was powered by birds. He set off not knowing that the birds came from the moon. So instead of taking him to another island, they took him back home to the moon. So he was a sort of an unintentional astronaut. But back in July 1969, the first real trip to the moon started. And it started at Cape Canaveral or Cape Kennedy, where many rockets to outer space have been launched. In fact, the space shuttle today is launched from the same place. The Saturn V rocket carrying the Apollo 11 astronauts set off to the moon in July 1969. And it carried not only Neil Armstrong on the left, but also Michael Collins and Buzz Aldrin. And they traveled the distance to the moon, which is 400,000 kilometers. And when they got there, Armstrong was the first one to go out on the surface of the moon. And on July 20th, 1969, he descended the ladder from the Eagle lunar module. And when he placed his foot on the surface of the moon, he said these famous words. That's one small step for man, one giant leap for mankind. Well, Aldrin followed uh, Armstrong out onto the surface of the moon and they spent a long time collecting samples and taking photographs of each other. And here's a photograph that Armstrong took of himself reflected in Buzz Aldrin's mask. And you'll notice that the spacesuit was an enormous thing which had all sorts of life support systems so that they could survive on the moon's surface, which of course doesn't have air. They collected not only rock samples and soil samples, but they also left behind a plaque which reminded people who might follow them and read that at a later date that they came in peace for all mankind. And it was signed by Armstrong, Collins, Aldrin and Richard Nixon, who was then President of the United States of America. So when somebody says to you, who was Neil Armstrong? You will know, of course, that he was the first person to set foot on the surface of the moon. Mm -hmm.